The coastal and southwest regions of our province will continue to face more heavy rainfall over the next 48 hours, while still recovering from the impacts of the widespread flooding. Late today, we are expecting a significant storm forecast to last into Wednesday afternoon. In some areas, such as the central coast, this could be the most intense storm yet. The province has already mobilized assets in the Bella Coola Valley in preparation. In southwest BC, Environment Canada is warning of extreme rainfall that may worsen existing flooding or create new flooding. This storm may not have the same level of intensity as we saw mid-month in some of our hardest hit areas, such as the Fraser Valley, but the cumulative effect of this succession of storms will be and continues to be a major challenge. As communities in coastal and southwest BC brace for a heavy storm this evening, the best approach is to avoid non-essential travel and wait out the weather. Safety remains our key consideration and if required, we will preemptively close more highways again as we have done with Highway 99 beginning at 4 p.m. this afternoon. With the ground already extremely saturated and heavy rains expected, proactive closures may be needed to ensure the safety of the traveling public. We don't take these decisions lightly again, but the current conditions are not typical and we need to keep everyone's safety uh, at the forefront. This event is very strong. It's the third consecutive storm in a week with very little respite in between these events. Uh, so the effects are cumulative. Uh, in addition, the freezing levels are climbing currently, perhaps up to 3,000 meters higher than the last two events. So snow melt is also a component of this event and will add to the storm totals of rain uh, into the rivers and, and creeks. And we urge everybody to follow the forecast, listen to the warnings, uh, listen to the authorities for all uh, recommendations.